Hi, I'm Elsa Brown, and my Stackathon project is called Cybernetic Music Box. Um, I was studying the Web Audio API, and I wanted to make something that would kind of be like an interactive music box in a web app. So the way that this works is you just, when you scroll, And the poem that I used is called um, All Watched Over by Machines of Loving Grace. It's a poem that was written in 1967 by Richard Brautigan. Um, so he was like part of the 60s, but also into this like techno utopian vision. Um, and I was interested also in the sort of synesthetic qualities that happen when data is processed because of studying like sound and data. So how everything gets turned into numbers really and then from there you can make like words become sounds or like colors become words so um looking into my code i uh made this happen by pretty much um writing a little program that would convert the poem um each line of the poem into a frequency based on a Unicode conversion. I originally wanted to convert, convert it by each letter, but that was kind of like overloading the system of my app. So I just cut it down to the number of lines. So the program um, right here, it uh, stores the values in an array. And then I use that later on. I wrote um, this will like design the layout of the page um, into different invisible divs. And then I use this API called scroll magic so that I could um, loop through all of the divs and then um, use tone.js to make a new instrument that would be set to the frequency of that line of the poem. Um, so yeah, um, some of, for tone.js, it was interesting because you have to, the way it works is you have an oscillator object and then an envelope that, um, that like sets different, basically start and stop effects on the oscillator, which is just a continuous wave. So every time you have to make a new oscillator, so that had to be like written into my scroll scenes. That was kind of interesting to figure out. Um, yeah, like originally I thought about doing different things, but I kind of like paired it back and I'm really happy with the way it came out. Um, Tone.js has a way that you can generate white, brown, or pink noise. So at one point I was going to have like images and try to like uh, get like the noise coming out, but I think this is enough. Um, something else, oh, I wanted to show the Flickr animations that I did with the text. I just Googled around and found this WebKit animation that I took from someone's GitHub. I cited them in the code, and I put two different Flickrs. That you can like adjust it by um, setting opacities. And then also quickly, I wanted to show my just like dependencies because I really just wanted to get a really like lightweight server up and running. There's no backend, so I used something called HTTP server. And then um, Browserify lets you use like require in your app. And that really helped me a lot. Um, so, oh wait, hold on. Uh, this is my GitHub and the website. That's my website, it's up there in a link. And then my Twitter, you can follow me for more projects like this, hopefully. Thank you.